In addition to uploading pages, numbers, and keynote files, you could also upload images and video. To do that, we're going to tap on this plus sign in the top right hand corner, and we're going to select upload photos and videos. You can also use your camera, your built-in camera, and snap a picture or video and automatically upload it, but I'm going to look for ones that I've already created. So I'm going to tap upload photos or videos. The first time you do this, just like any of the other programs, it will ask for access to your photos. I'm going to tap OK. And I'm going to go select my camera roll. And I can select multiple items at a time. It'll allow you to bulk upload multiple items. If you watched my other tutorials, you, this picture will be familiar. And so will this video. So I'm going to tap on both of those and then hit the check. Down at the bottom of your screen, it will say one of two items uploading. That will only be there momentarily, then it will go away. But you can always check on the status of your uploads by tapping on the three bars on the left hand side and going to the upload section. So here it will show you the two objects that are uploading. It will say my image is uploading, so it's in the process. You can see it working here. And then this one here says that it is queued. So when it's completed that first task, then it will move on to the next task. Once these are uploaded, you will then be able to see them back from your drive page.